Hi friends and fellow flute enthusiasts, thanks for tuning in to Johnny's Flute Reviews. I'm Johnny Lipford and since 2002 I've dedicated myself to everything flute. I teach, perform, and record full time with the Native American flute. I post videos here on YouTube covering flute tips, tutorials, original songs, and cover songs to showcase how versatile the Native American flute is. If you're new here and interested in becoming a more emotive flute player, or you just love listening to the sounds of the Native American flute, be sure you subscribe and hit that little bell so you're notified every time a new video drops. Now, let's dive into a flute from my personal collection. Welcome back. In this episode of Johnny's Flute Reviews, we're going to be looking at a flute made by John Norris. This is in the key of C sharp, and it is made from sassafras with a walnut block. Now, this is one of John's um, standard um, concert uh, Native American style flutes. Uh, the holes are in a straight line here. Um, as we get a little bit into larger flutes, maybe a little bit um, lower than this, and every once in a while, John will make a flute of this size where he positions the finger holes to kind of curve off to the side to make it more ergonomic for a flute player, uh, especially one that, you know, is a little shorter, their arms ain't, aren't as long, uh, or they struggle to reach that bottom hole of the flute. For me, this flute's pretty comfortable. Um, and for me, for this being kind of a mid to low range flute, it has a pretty robust voice. Um, it's hard to explain like the voice of a flute. Uh, we all have these little um, characteristics or adjectives that we kind of throw around and try to name what the voice is. For me, like I said, this one's robust. It's clear. It's a little, um, a little raspy and a little nasally, which is not normally um, what I would say about <laughs> The voice of a flute but for some reason it reminds me in this particular flute it has that quality so again with playing a bass flute I'm gonna keep this one a little bit closer to my body um, you know push my head down just a little bit looking down a little bit so that way it keeps my elbow back and I'm able to um, comfortably get rid of of this this kink right here so there's a video that I did for tips for playing bass flutes. So check that out if you haven't already. So here we go. This is in a natural environment. Again, if you're tuning in again and you've seen flute reviews, you know that I don't add reverb uh, to this area of the flute. Here we go. a really <clears throat> excuse me just a really rock solid um, voice on this particular flute um, I love to record with this one it comes through very clear um, and as a matter of fact I use this on the title cut for migration uh, a CD that came out early 2019 so uh, if you haven't already checked that out you'll hear this you'll also hear an E E major flute, transverse flute in that particular piece. So again, this is made by John Norris of John Norris Music and Arts. He's based out of North Carolina and John's been making flutes for a very long time. Um, I believe since the late 90s or so. So pushing, uh, pushing 30 years with, uh, with making flutes or being around flutes. And he's a wealth 
of knowledge when it comes to the history and evolution of flutes in North America. So if you have a burning question about the history or evolution of the flute in uh, North America, uh, if you ever get a chance to chat with John at a festival, he's a lot of fun to chat with. So. Anyway, uh, look him up. I'll drop a link in the description below to his website. You'll also find some links to um, gear that I like to use in recording and live performances, as well as some other activities uh, focused around music and music business. Um, and uh, below you'll also find some resources uh, to improve your flute playing and help you out along your flute journey. And so check those out in the description below and make sure you subscribe. If you like this flute review, I do these weekly as well as post a music video every week as well. So an original song, cover song, flute tip, tutorial, or a flute review. So uh, stay tuned. I appreciate you um, tuning into this episode. I will see you in the next flute review.